keep you guys updated as to whether or not they had everything. We're here early. Like we drove in last night. It's so pretty out here. This is just a pretty area. Just to be in. People are starting to get here. It doesn't open till 10. It's like 940 right now. So hopefully we'll be able to find what we're looking for. And I am super excited. So let me grab my mask. And then we're going to, I guess, get in line. These people, like I said, are arriving. And you're interested to see if we got the pack system that I was looking for. Just keep watching. Okay, so I'm in line. The flags are at half staff for the death of Supreme Justice Ruth. That's nice for them to honor her like that. Okay, okay. so we were able to find most of it, but there was like four things that we didn't find, which was one of the gray inserts for the jewelry, the pull-out drawer, the door for the smaller cabinet, and the glass shelf. So anyway, we were able to find the glass shelf at Round Rock which we're currently in Live Oaks. So we're driving to Round Rock, which is like an hour and a half away before we head home to pick up that glass shelf and then also the adapter for the lights. Now, I didn't find the glass pull-out drawer. So, or I didn't find the pull-out drawer. So, I'll just have to see when that one comes back in stock and order it online or maybe if we happen to come down but no biggie the door no biggie in fact initially I wanted to leave that shelf open because that's where I'm gonna put my bags so it's not a big deal that I didn't get that and the gray insert I don't care about that either if I get it or not, it's not a big deal to me. So there was only one thing that I really want that I didn't get and it was the pull out drawer, which is where you put the jewelry inserts and you can pull it out. And the only reason I wanted that was so that if I laid my small leather goods in there, I could pull it out and see them. But again, it's not a big deal um, if I get it later on, it'll be okay. We got the core of the whole unit and I'm happy I'm really happy with what we found and what we got and I'm excited to see it come together so we also need to try to head home soon hopefully we'll be home not too late today okay so we made it to the Ikea round rock since we have all of this load already I didn't want to get off the car and so my husband went in and it's gonna be a while I think because I said that we could pick it up between 13 to 1600 and so 13 would have been one and so 16 would be four o'clock so hopefully it's 333 right now so technically should only be like 20 something minutes hopefully and we still have to drive home so um, I actually ended up finding that other piece that I needed the pull-out tray I found it online ordered it they're sending it to me by October 2nd hopefully it was $40 total so it's $30 for the pull-out tray and then $10 for shipping which I thought was fine 
So we're picking up the other two pieces from here and then we'll be heading home. Thank God I'm tired. I'm ready to go. And I'm excited. I'm excited to see this come together. Okay, so we made it home last night about almost midnight. And here's the tray. Like, that is way bigger than I thought it was going to be. I don't know why. And again, just dumped all our stuff out in the garage. So, let me show you guys the boxes here we had to bring on our trailer. And it's like three big boxes. And then we had to put a lot of the stuff in the back of the truck there, all of the smaller pieces. And I did end up getting those other two pieces from Ikea. And <laughs> I guess I didn't realize that it said pick up the next day. That's why we hadn't gotten a confirmation, but Thank you, Jesus, that they were nice and went ahead and fulfilled our order. But that Ikea in Round Rock was busy. Like, there was a queue line, and it was mass chaos. I mean, there was tons of people there. So, luckily, we were able to get the last two pieces that we needed. And the other piece is going to come by mail. So, yeah, we're going to work on this today. And so maybe by next video, I'll be able to show you guys the actual pack system in my room. Okay. So I'm going to start clearing out all this stuff. And I want to show you what it looks like before the next video. And this just became an overload. So I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to put my longer coats and some shorter coats in there. And then just get rid of this whole thing here. And maybe help me with my closet here and getting some of my longer coats out of here because my poor coats, they're just like on the floor there like that. And I really want to get them off the ground. And so here is the, a picture of the pack system. Now, word of advice, don't forget this when you go to Ikea <laughs> because we forgot it. And it just was a mess. But that's kind of what it's going to look like here. That's what I selected. And this has changed up a bit. But that's kind of an idea of what it's going to look like. It's not going to have that many shelves. Uh, and I added more baskets, as you saw, that I had. So, yeah, I'm going to be clearing out all of this stuff today. And we're going to probably lose some wall space. So maybe some of this stuff will be coming down. But I'm excited. I'm ready for a change in here. The only thing is, is that it will be white and it won't be this brown rain color like my desk and my table. And that's why I held on to these for so long because they matched and I'm just over it. I just want something more practical. And I'll keep my desk and this table because I just love these pieces i've had them for a long long time like a long long time i've had my desk and i've done a tour of my office before but i will not get rid of my desk it's just very first actually high-end piece that i purchased and i've had it for more than i would say more than 15 years i've had it maybe even 20. so that's what's on the agenda for today so like i, I said, will catch you all in the next video and hopefully this will come to life thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one bye